back. <laughs> we right now we are in the middle of too much May. I'm in the middle of too much May. I'll put it. I'll let you know that. And um, there's been something that's been flowing through my mind since uh, a, a conversation I had uh, that's going to be released um, in just a few just a few weeks. So it's a conversation I had with Dr. Sarah Coxon, and it was a wonderful conversation. And you'll this is like a teaser to the teaser. Um, and you'll get another video related to that in some in the near future. But the reason that I decided to come on here was to talk a little bit about hustle and flow. Right now, I am in a place where you're actually experiencing Nemo with high energy. This is this is I would say that I'm I'm grounded and at the same time there's a lot of energy flowing through me. And I'm using that energy to create and create just as authentically as I can. And the thing about that there was just that the, the biggest thing for me was to look at it from the standpoint of, well, I guess the way I would say is that I feel like I'm in flow. I feel like I'm in flow. It's not going to be hard for me to create videos each and every day to share with you. It's not going to be hard for me to create uh, conversations and record them and share them with you. It's not going to be hard for me to go forth and really send out different emails and build up my YouTube channels, like all these different things. It's actually going to be fairly easy. And I think a part of me has been afraid of doing that for the reason of being misaligned. Because at that time, if I had just gone and done it then, I think I would have just been focused on the hustle. What more can I do to get more people onto my email list? What more can I do to, to make more videos? What more can I do? And it was coming from a place of actually scarcity and lack. And now, now we're in this place of too much May, and all I can think of are just new opportunities to do more than, than, than is required, to do more than most people might handle. And here goes the thing, the thing that I'm realizing here is that honestly, it's probably a more authentic version of me at this, in this moment. It's not to say that this is who I am forever and, and so on and so forth, but right now, Showing up this way is really important. And it's easy for me to do that. And so you'll see a lot of activity. You'll see a lot of new content. You'll see a lot of uh, requests. I might make Facebook posts. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to be too much. You know, I'm going to be way too much. That's my filter. And it doesn't feel, it doesn't need to feel like a hustle. I have a really good feeling that I'm just going to be in flow. And thanks to this conversation with, with Sarah, I actually know what to look for that's going to keep me either in or out of flow. That's going to get me into the hustle mode versus being in the flow mode. You're going to see some things and there's going to be a lot of results regardless, but the energy source and where it's coming from are tremendously different. The Nemo showing up to you, to, showing up in front of you today, playing too much May is not coming from a place of hustling. And I ain't got time for that coming from a place that's much gentler and much more in service of you as opposed to just being in service of me. So I actually encourage you to watch that video. It's coming out. This is a teaser to the teaser. I have another video that, that's going to be coming out there um, soon. I actually just got a, a message here from Karen. So, hey, Karen, good to see you. Uh, what's the difference between ease and stretch? That's a great question. Um, let's see. I want to make a separate video around the difference between ease and stretch. In the meantime, I'd love to hear from you as to why is that question important to you and what do you think is the difference there? Let's start a conversation about that. Let's go. You know, that's my thing to, to start in, in continuing conversations. So I'm going to end this one specifically around hustle and flow. And this is an invitation to watch the, uh, the YouTube video that we have with uh, with Sarah. You can go to enjoyment.com slash YouTube. It's going to be available in a few days, but I don't know when you're going to watch this. So just go to enjoyment.com slash YouTube and uh, look up for look out for the video with me and Sarah Coxon. And you can also find us on the Outliers, Pioneers and Mavericks podcast, which is also coming out and we'll be capturing a lot of the long form content that we're doing in a way that you can watch and listen to while on your way to work or at the gym or so on and so forth. All right. So we'll make that happen. Um, Karen, I haven't forgot. We'll talk about ease and stretch 
And um, I'm looking forward to continuing the conversation and continuing the month with you. We'll talk soon. Bye. Now, here goes the thing. I found that my um, to, to be with you right here, I need to push a separate button to turn off the live. Catch you later. Bye.